Now that you have the OSC downloaded, first step is to go ahead and extract the zip file. Now that the zip file is extracted, you'll notice that there's a folder called prepare stick. Navigate into that. And here you'll see the OSC ISO. You're free to use this to go and deploy things like virtual machines or devices where you can mount an ISO file directly. In the case of a physical device, you'll want to leverage this prepare stick utility to create a bootable USB stick. Simply double click on this, elevate via UAC, and within here you'll see that it'll point to the ISO file, just verify that this is a correct location, and then you'll also want to make sure that you have a USB stick attached. If you don't, now's a great time to go ahead and plug that in. And now that you see that that's actually shown here, you can go ahead and select the start writing process. Once you start writing the USB stick, it will erase all data on it, so make sure it's something where you don't need any of the data on that drive. Now that the USB stick is created, you can proceed to installing this on a piece of uh, physical hardware or in a VM via the USB stick.